Welcome to solve the virtual lab at NITK. In this short tutorial, I will explain you how to use this interface to do the velocity analysis of slider crank mechanism. As we have seen in the other simulations, this interface mainly consists of three sections. One for the animation, second one for changing the variables, and third one for the control. In the animation section, you have scaled position and velocity diagram which are dynamic to the values you give. By moving the slider, you can vary the radius, length, and angular velocity of the crank. And corresponding changes can be seen in the animation. If you want to change the angle to analyze the various positions of the crank mechanism, pause the animation by clicking here in controls and then change the angle here. Once you set it up for the required angle theta 2, corresponding velocities can be found here. Press play to see and analyze changing velocities of the slider crank mechanism. Thanks for watching this tutorial.